The weather may not have been that festive, but the tens of thousands lining the soggy streets of Sydney certainly were. The Sydney Mardi Gras Parade is the culmination of nearly a month's worth of events celebrating sexual diversity. Gay, lesbian, transgender and intersex participants uniting from across the country and the world. It's a way for them to express themselves, celebrate and give some visibility to who they are. After a slight delay, the Dykes on Bikes got the revellers revved up, unleashing what can only be described as a flood of fabulousness. Are you enjoying yourself tonight? I am, darling. I'm with the Asian marching boys having an awesome time. Happy Mardi Gras! I've been doing it for eight years and I would do it in a wheelchair. I love it. And clearly so do others. From the disabled and youth groups to police and firefighters, Australia's gay community and its supporters spread far and wide. A multitude of nationalities was also on display, with some members participating for the first time. The parade's message of infinite love transcending more barriers than ever. Over 30 years ago it started as a demonstration and now it's a celebration. And whether you're gay or straight, come rain or shine, the Mardi Gras is the place to feel fun, festive or in my case, a little overdressed. But the parade's political roots remain very much intact. As in previous years, equal marriage was a major issue, with activists and politicians pushing for change. It's really important for equality for all people to have the same opportunity to love and to be able to have the same rights. I think increasingly Australians know that we can give marriage equality, give one group of people rights that others have without taking anything away. Taking the parade home, a multi-layered tribute to Australian pop icon Kylie Minogue. Four floats, an army of dancers and plenty of gratitude from the lady herself. Oh my God! Sydney, tonight we are showing the world what we're made of. Putting another exclamation point on the latest display of the dearest, the queerest and the fearless. Manit Sigas, World News Australia.